Cardi B says she had great men, multiple men that were faithful, and she left them for offset. Let's talk about it. Praise to the Most High Yah Shalom. Thank you for tuning in to another episode. Today I'm back at it in them trenches, handling that business. Man, when I tell you that you cannot make this stuff up, man, Cardi B is one of these women that a lot of women support and follow regardless of how ignorant and stupid the stuff that she says, you know, is. Man, I'm going to play a clip. And this is why I've said it time and time again. Women, you are doing yourself a huge disservice following women like Cardi B listening to their music following their stories having sympathy empathy in your heart towards their situation okay how many how many times have you heard people say the grass is not greener on the other side now keep in mind Cardi B is nowhere near a set-apart woman. Nowhere near. Even if Offset gave her the benefit of the doubt, saying, okay, she's an ex-stripper, okay, an ex-prostitute, even if he gave her the benefit of the doubt and said maybe she had changed her ways, nope, still planted a baby in her, and she's coming out with harlot stripper songs Got people's grandma uh, thinking they got some of the best moose knuckle on the face of this earth when that WAP song came out. I tell you, you can't make this stuff up. Cardi B is good. If, if you as a woman still feel like you should be supporting these lawless reprobate people, men and women, after they say some of the most stupid stuff, I truly can't help you. You might read your Bible, but you're reading your Bible through the stupid lens. You ain't going to be able to comprehend nothing. This woman said, I left multiple faithful men because I wasn't happy. I left them for cheating men that made me happy. What? What? You left men that did right by you. That didn't make you happy. But the thugs made you happy. Now you're out here, got your whole family business in the street. That made you happy. That's what you left for? Man, there is a term called limerence. Limerence. This is where a woman is infatuated, you know, with a guy. There's a fantasy of a guy that she wants to be with, but this man is no good for her. No good. And you got to understand, man, your demons truly attract the demons in other people. You got to look at what, what, uh, the, 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 the offset, you know, make music that's going to make people uh, turn to the most high Yah, or does he make music that provokes your flesh same thing with Cardi B was she sitting up there dancing butt naked to, to gospel no so your demons attach or attract to other people it doesn't take it doesn't take 
a, a, a GED or a high school. It doesn't take a, 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 a 60 year old full of wisdom to determine that's pretty stupid. And this is where I said a lot of women have the same mindset as Cardi B. And it's the demons in you that's attracted to stuff that's going to cause you to suffer. I do not feel bad. I do not feel bad for the stuff that these people go through in their foolishness. These people don't even realize they are filled, overflowing with demons. Overflowing. You mean to tell me, this is oftentimes what you'll hear people say, the faithful guys, the good guys, they don't make me happy. They are boring. But guess what? Boring don't have you airing out all this stuff on social media. Boring doesn't have you uh, sitting up wondering who he's with because you got somebody that's faithful that comes home to you. Tell you, man, that is, Cardi B's not the only woman with this uh, delusional reprobate mindset. And these women, here's the thing. They live life with a lot of regret. You didn't wasted your time on a plum fool. Gave your wound. Gave your wound over to a plum fool. And you had men that wanted to do right by you. And you think you just going like a lot of them do. Run down there to that family court and divorce yourself. And you the first woman in line to get a good man. Cha! <laughs> how many, listen to me, how many of these good men you think that she's talking about are raised, oh, 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 she divorced Offset. How many of these men do you think is wanting to line back up and get with a woman like Cardi B, a contentious woman like Cardi B? You are out of your mind. I'm telling you, you cannot make this stuff up. Roll that footage. I have dated men that are they were extremely faithful to me. Were they ugly? No. <laughs> oh my God. Mad cute, yeah. super faithful to mm -hmm. me. But it's like a lot of people, you know, when I when I, that whole cheating scandal came out, a lot of people said like, you deserve somebody faithful. But just because somebody like extremely faithful don't make you happy because that's true. The guys that were extremely faithful to me, it just didn't work out. Mm -hmm. You just need to find somebody that you really in love with and make you happy. And you really been fucking doing me dirty after so many fucking years that I mother fucking up your ass. Not even a fucking thank you that I got for your big ass. And it's so crazy that I gotta go to the fucking internet because whenever I tell you something, you don't take seriously.